Today I'll be reviewing one of the more rare variants or copies of the British S6 gas mask, that being the Turkish SR10 gas mask. The Turkish SR10, which is their designation for this mask, is manufactured by MKEC. Um, while the British varied away or straight away from the S6 design and adopted the S10 and moved on to the FM12, the Turkish actually stuck with this design for quite some time. This, uh, these both are manufactured in 2002, and one of the biggest uh, differences between the British and Turkish is that they actually offered this to their militaries and law enforcement in different colors. So you have um, two masks here. That This one looks a little bit tanner than this one. This one looks gray. But uh, unfortunately, mine is actually sun damaged, while this one's actually how it would normally look like. Um, there's not many, many photos out there of this being used, though from what I've seen is that most of the time it'll look like this. Um, it, it does come with uh, left or right handed, um, just like the S6, you'd kind of have to just look for that model, whichever pops up. 40 millimeter cartridge, same, same uh, style voice emitter. Um, still has that same fisheye kind of effect when you wear it with the lenses. Um, as you can tell, there there is also a big circle uh, on the sides here. And that being is because in the mold, you get the, the Turkish military actually offers a copy with a drink tube. So yes, technically, there is a S6 model out there with a drink tube uh, designated the SR10 ST. Um, the SR10 ST, it... Um, basically would have like a, an Israeli civilian mask where you'd have the drink tube kind of like threaded here and you'd thread on the, uh, the little tube and you drink out of a canteen. Uh, I do have one on the way to my collection. Unfortunately, it's not here yet, so I can't uh, display it for you guys. Though, structurally with that, the only difference with that is because it just has an out, outer drink tube and an inner drink tube. Um, I'll put one mask to the side because they're both the same and kind of showcase it. Here's the uh, the front of the mask. Uh, yeah, like I said, uh, if you've seen an S6 or owned an S6, you, you'd you already understand what this mask is about. Uh, the only difference here is that it was manufactured in Turkey and used for the military and law enforcement. Uh, there's a drink tube model available for it. But otherwise, structurally, it's all the same, honestly. Um, very, very nice uh, variant. Uh, not not too common either. Uh, manufactured in 2002, so accurate head harness to to it. And I have an S6 uh, placed aside so I can do a side by side comparison to it. Very large, large voice emitter. You have a very wide um, sweat hole, moisture collector. So I'm put that aside right here. And here is a is a normal. British S6 gas mask. Um, like I said, not much of a difference. I really, I really like, um, I really like the British S6 model though. The rubber, the, I, I just naturally like black rubber masks more. Uh, colored rubber kind of puts me off. I, I don't see it as uh, offering as much protective qualities as a normal one, a normal black rubber gas mask. Um, oh. Oh, speaking of which, I was the inner head harness or inner uh, not head harness inner peripheral seal is different too. This one kind of has like one of those inflatable, just like the ND Mark V, the the inflated um, secondary peripheral seal. This one does not. This one actually has just a interned peripheral seal. Difference on that. Other than that, similar similarities are the same. Kind of have the the stamps on the top from the manufacturer date stamp manufacturer stamp. Same with the Turkish one. Kept that the same. This one was made by LBR Company in 1982. Kind of gives you a bit of a perspective on when they got rid of this and the fact that they, the Turkish military still uses this. You have the double threaded uh, 40 millimeter threading there. As with the Turkish one, you don't. This head harness is not accurate to the mask. I know this is an M40 head harness. I just got it like that. Um, not so much of a wide sweat hole. It's less moisture gap right here. You do have the drink 
drink to or something inside. And a little bit of a nut scout. But yeah, other than that, pretty much the same. I'm glad I could actually get a hold of this mask. Um, I do, uh, especially since I have two, uh, I am expected to get more. Um, at least for the United States collectors, this is actually a pretty uncommon mask to get. I didn't even know that these were available on the market yet uh, until I was offered offered a few. So, so yep. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, just comment and subscribe for more. Uh, in other words, this is pretty much it. The uh, Turkish SR10 slash Turkish SR10 ST for a Drink 2 model compared to the British S6.